hey, I'm the Wolfman, and I'm coming to you today to show you a really cool project that you can do with any hard sheath knife and a couple of supplies. So I'm going to start by showing you the tools that we're going to put together today. This is the gadget pouch. This is available from Condor. It has a little bit of a pouch in the front that you can open up. You can put things in here like your fire starter or anything like that. It's a great little tool to have out on the trail. It also has inside a little zipper pouch right there. You can store things inside like a little LED torch, anything like that. The next thing we're going to use is your hard sheath knife. Now this is the K-Bar Tanto blade, but the blade itself really doesn't matter and there's a whole uh, school and discussion of which knife is the best knife, but this is the knife that I use and it has a nice hard sheath. And of course the other thing we're going to be using is some 550 paracord. Starting with the pouch, the first thing that we notice is on the back, it has what we call molly strapping. Now I'm sure pretty much anybody who's into the outdoor circuit or military equipment is aware of what molly striping is. It's basically a form of weave and we can take this strap and we can push it under this strap and push it over this strap and it allows us to make everything a little bit more expandable. It's a really great thing. It hasn't really taken off in the civilian outdoor market, but it's very prevalent and especially in the American outdoor military market. Now with the molly strapping, you'll notice that it obviously won't fit on this hard case. So a really easy solution to this is to undo your molly strapping, just like this, and then take your paracord. We're gonna undo the paracord, throw it off to the side, and we're gonna start to wrap it around this and weave it onto this. Essentially, we're gonna make the hard case on this knife usable with molly. And how we're gonna do that is I'm gonna take my rope, I'm just going to thread it through the back. Now it doesn't have to be threaded this way. There's all sorts of different ways to do it. And we're just going to weave that on. Now as we're going through that, we're going to take this, we're going to open up the strap, and we're going to set it right down here on the pouch. And the reason that we do this is that way you know, I don't have to fight with it later. It's just going to work very nicely for me. Now you see I'm just going to hold this on, just like that. And I'm going to take the other end of my string and I'm just going to push it right through. Now I'm just going to continue doing that until what happens is this is all knotted in and then this holds it on to the pouch. So I'm going to go ahead and knit that all up. Now that this is wrapped up, when I fold this over, I notice that it pretty much under here will wrap on to the next set of molly strapping. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna snug this up, pull that nice and tight right there like that, pack it all in, take my strapping, and I'm now going to weave it just like this. There we are, push that through there and pull that out. What that does is allow multiple points of contact on this so when it latches on through, it's gonna hold a little bit better. So the next thing I do now is just continue wrapping, but instead of wrapping on my piece of equipment here, I'm gonna wrap it through, just like this. What I do once in a while is I'm gonna stop and measure just to make sure that this goes out down to about right there. And then I'm gonna start weaving it a little bit more. Now when I bend this over, I notice that the webbing in here and the paracord are starting to line up. So again, I'm gonna just put this down. The next step is just to basically attach this nylon paracord that we have right here 
to the pouch on the next layer of the molly strapping. And we do that simply by going over the top. Just like this, we're gonna weave that right in there over the top, pull it all down. So now if you'll notice on the side, there's these little grommet holes here and here. What I've done on this side is I'll flip that over so you can see it. I'm just going to take my paracord and now that it's all through, I'm just going to push it through just like this. So now that'll come up. And what that does is just give me a little bit more security. If your knife doesn't have this on it, don't worry about it. Just keep on going on the outside. Keep on trucking, moving your way through. And you'll notice at the back here that it's gone on nice and flat and smooth and even. We want to try to make sure we can keep it like that. That's just going to make it a little nicer for you when you're wearing that on your leg. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take my leg strap, pull it up, and lock this over just like that. Now just to test fit this to make sure that once all of this nylon rope comes all the way down that it's going to work out really well. So I'm going to go ahead here and just finish wrapping that up. So now to finish this off, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the little oval shaped hole that's right there in my rope. I'm just gonna feed that through and tie that into a knot. Just like this. I'm just gonna tie that off. And there we go. Now what this is gonna do is all of this is gonna hold this weave on. Keep that nice and tight. Now all you have to do is throw this under here, get it down, pull down as well as you can. Nice and snug, snap that on. There you have it. So essentially what I've done is I have taken this knife sheath, the paracord, and this little tiny gadget compartment and made this into a Molly compatible knife sheath. It allows me a few other little things too, as well as having this cool pouch on here, which I can, like I said, I could put an electric torch in, fire starter, fishing kit, anything that I wanted. At the back, I also have a bunch of paracord. If I ever need to deploy that, I basically just unstitch it and off we go. Now I'll put this on so you can kind of see what this looks like on my leg, and that's it. The project is pretty much completed. So you can see when this is on my hip, that it happens to be at just the right height that I can get in here. I can unzip this pocket, I can pull anything out that's in it. I can get at the front pocket as well, snap that up, get anything that's in it, put it back together, and of course, if I need my knife, I can get at that no problem too. It's a really great and useful little tool, and as you can see, it's not that really obtrusive on my leg. It doesn't really bother anything. It doesn't really stick out too terribly much. Without even looking at it, I know what everything is. I really like the way it sits on my leg. This little pouch is very useful, paracord, you can always use that. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoy how I put this little pouch on here and created this sheath and made it into Molly compatible. I get a lot of different comments from users who have different suggestions and things like that. I'd like to invite any of you who have done anything like this or modifications to your knife or sheath to please post it as a video response as I'm definitely interested in seeing what else is out there, what other people have thought of. I've heard of all different ideas including things using bicycle inner tubing and all sorts of great stuff. So I'd like to thank you for watching this video. I'm the Wolfman. Please consider subscribing.